I always play the villain, and I played a London, New York, whatever villain in my sleep. Too, ug <laughs> too ugly to get a romantic lead, as you can see, right? <laughs> but with, with, with taking on a role like this, especially when you're shooting on location in Kiev, where it was all there, and underneath your feet, and I don't want to sort of go into this whole spiritual sort of crazy thing about what we're doing, but when I first got given the... Um, the, the role and the character, and I always said to the director, I said, listen, for some reason, something's telling me that I want at some stage somebody to feel sorry for this man. Through all of what he's doing, none of us were born murderers. You, you know, I'm a great believer, you're a product of your environment, or, you know, the apple doesn't fall far from the tree, or because he's this character, he, he, he gave his own mother up in the church and watched his mother get executed. So, from him growing up, obviously there must have been, because for me it's always about a backstory before you can create the character, but it was lucky that these guys, these, this character was there and, it, and it, it was real. But there was always a minute in there that I wanted, and I found it, and you'll probably see it when you watch the movie, I found a moment where I said to, I said to uh, the George, I said, I want to find a moment where people will actually, even if it's a split second, feel sorry for him. Or see what he's afraid of. Yeah. What makes him actually be human? Yeah, he's terrified of himself. You know, as I said before, I mean, there's, there's horrific scenes between uh, uh, my character and Sam's character. And even when you see the, 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 the hallucinations and... Look, he's, he, he, he wants to be loved. He can't find love. And again, even around that character, you know, he, he's just killing unconditionally there's obviously something within him that's making him that way. And that was the biggest challenge for me, you know, to, to get into his soul and get into his being and his psyche. Why the hell are you doing this? You know, a, 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 a villain in, when you watch a Hollywood villain, if he's got a boss, you know, it's, it's easy. He wants to be the boss. Right. Stalin was that person. Because, you know, he probably killed the one before him. <laughs> Do you see what I'm saying? You know, he had that that drive, and then that for me that that was what the challenge was. You know, and he had so many arcs and 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 so many twists and turns. But within him, there's always got to be something there that why is he doing this? And hopefully, you know, I found that within the character, and that was a challenging thing for me.